Yeah, now it's like underground, is... so I have to just intuit where it's going. God damn it. <laughs> so much of it's underground. <laughs> you don't even know how much more of it has become underground. Oh. This, is, this is an underground train. Very it's few people know about an it. underground railroad. I've lost track of where the fuck we're supposed to take this thing because this indicator, like this top of the map indicator is really in, in a fit, like insufficient. Just, you don't see the hub? Okay, I do see the, the house hub. icon that's 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 white and stands out from all the other ones and is the top layer probably. Probably. And it's been our base the entire game. There we go. That looks good. What have you done? <laughs> Dude. It's just... It's so fucking great. That's the oh my god. That's the kind of through the mountain path that kills like a hundred people in the process of it being built. She'll be coming through the mountain when she comes to chug a chew. Thousands dead <laughs> in the mountain when she comes chug a chew. Oh no. She'll be. <sighs> oh, I can do it. No, I no, can... no, no. Do it. No, yes! No, no. My self respect, yes. it's gone. You put the track through the track. Yes. Uh, better hope these things don't have durability. Oh. So remember, you have to get to the, you have to approach it from the opposite side. Oh, we can just loop around some shit again. It's fine. When she comes. Yeah, <laughs> All right, Grandma. Yeah, it's because it was, yeah, that song was probably yeah. written when you were born. Yeah. I'll be coming around the mountain yeah. when yeah. she comes. Did you? Disposed. <laughs> when the lights go, go out on the city. It'll be coming around. <laughs> no. Oh, no, man. No. There we go. That seems like a good enough route. What the fuck? How did you get it to go? I feel like it's going to crash into something unexpectedly. It, We're going to find out oh, the hard well, way. Know, we'll crash the game, apparently. Holy shit. We're going to find out the hard way which object the train collides with. It's going to be real unfortunate. Too sharp of a turn. Why'd you make it fucking impossible track, Keith? God damn. Yeah, it's just how could I? I'm clearly the one out of order here. All right, we'll just tear up that little bit of rail. And then that's a conveyor belt bird. Get it together. <laughs> there we go. There he... Ah, you son of a there bitch. We have it. I actually can't move. <laughs> well, just stand still and the train will get you out in a bit. No. Ow. Oh, I didn't no. have my jetpack on. Oh, we got to try this. We got to see what happens if we derail the train. No. Like literally. It's derail expensive. The train. It's expensive. Worth it. Oh. I want to break the train. I know, nah. but it's just going to crash OBS. <laughs> you know it. I know. Well, so we'll do it at the end of the session. <laughs> Alrighty, well, I'm very proud of ourselves. Where's the train? I want to take it for a spin. I've got to. I've. I. My heart is crying out for me to take the train on our giant path and see what the fuck happens. Why does it say that it's unable to reach the next stop? Uh. It should all be connected, right? Put put a train down. We'll we'll. Wait, why is it going this direction? Can we configure which direction the train goes? Um. Hmm. I guess logic wise, based on the way that the. Based on the way that the two, all the freight spots are, I guess the entire, the main train station must be backwards. Oh. I guess I'm gonna quickly copy paste its name. There we go. So I can keep its name. Can we put a train here so we can go to the train station? Uh, where was the train station again? 
Oh yeah, vehicles. Train station. Oh. Game really stopped moving for a second there. Okay. Crouching others clearance. Oh, the the powerful. There we go. Because yeah, it has to be going in the direction so that it, the cars would be behind it. Oh, so the it. freight cars work yeah. together. Yeah, okay. so it, it was backwards. Which means the other I one might be say, backwards they too. They made the train stations look really fucking nice. They yeah, look it, it is an, it's a neat building. Awesome. All right, did you put a train down? I want to. I want to ride it around. I've got to see what this entire like thing looks like. It looks so fun. Next stop is the octotangular mistake. And it doesn't say invalid, so it's probably coming. Wait, the train is automatically coming to us? Yeah, I just set up its timetable. <gasps> here comes our son. All right, well, it's gonna take a while to get here. Chuga, chuga, gaga. Baby train <laughs> noises. <laughs> Confused baby train noises, brackets, anime, yellow text, subtitle. <laughs> anime, yellow text. I know exactly what you mean. Yeah. Hey, do you think that this poisonous gas that I'm going to stand on top of is poisonous? Oh, yeah. Smell uh -huh. that refined oil gas. You having yourself some nice oil refinery suppository? Mmm. I don't think you're supposedatory do that. Ha 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 ha. Oh shit. We put the oh shit in OSHA. Give me a bit of. Oh, here it comes. Here it comes. Where? Where? Here it comes. I don't see it. You don't see it? No. Where is it? It's right down there. Can you hear it? Oh, yeah, I can kind of see it. <clears throat> it's a little slow. It's a train. Going uphill through mountains, you monster. <laughs> you, well, made, okay. you, made, you made it do a whoop-de-whoop. -whoop. <laughs> I made it do multiple whoop-de-whoops. It's coming all on its own. It's moving. The timetable works. It's really simple to set up, apparently. It just, the, just, you just have to have your train stations face the right way. Because apparently when you place them, there's an arrow. Don't fuck it up. No! <laughs> no. All right, all right. I'm making it come. We were gonna watch it, observe it, do the thingy. Now it'll never do all the right. thingy. I wanted to see if it was gonna offload or not. I don't even know if it's. It probably didn't pick up any resources in the first place, actually. Yeah, we probably didn't instruct it to pick up anything, so it probably just came. Yeah, I don't know. I'm not sure if I know how. Empty. Ah, shit. <laughs> I thought it you, would stop. Nope. I thought it would stop. Nope. You left it with a given acceleration and it goes. <laughs> I All thought right. trains could immediately stop. Well, you got your wish. It's going faster. <laughs> Goodbye, train. But I wanted to ride it. Now it's gone. Yeah, well, well you fucked that up. Now you gotta chase it. When, it. when it comes back, I'll get into it and we'll... Uh, I know well, the, fa okay. the fastest way to find it is to run backwards on the track. <laughs> That's nothing could true, go, but scary. Nothing okay. could go wrong there. I'm gonna head over to the quartz station because I think that we need to check this, like, see how we actually load up with quartz. <laughs> I just love that the fact. I just love that the fucktoberthon is going back to Quagmore. No, yeah, that joke's from yesterday. We don't. We don't use day old stale how, jokes. Yeah, we do. I don't. I try to come up with new Family Guy references. <laughs> There's no such thing. We both. We, the only way to do that would be to watch Family Guy. We both know you're not doing that. Because I haven't watched TV in like four years at this point. I, I, instead of watching TV, I have hobbies and it fucking sucks. <laughs> Children never have hobbies and ADHD at the same time. It does not end well for you because you're just doing you know every hobby at every moment simultaneously yeah some one day you're gonna wake up and realize that you don't have hobbies you have chores <laughs> you have art chores nothing like optimization to improve your hobbies uh, why are you so slow put your legs on oh good idea I'm catching up with you oh i crashed into you because you have a hitbox 
eat my shit, fuck mm, though. Nah. Now I'm moving fast. I'm Sonic nah. the fuck boy. Bip. No, what are you doing? Don't Sonic be faster than me. Sonic the fuck boy. B -b 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 Sonic the fuck the boy. Fuck boy. <laughs> The Sonic the Tails has boy. two buttholes, clearly because he has two tails. Knuckles has four penises because he's an echidna. Those numbers don't match up across any of the three. <laughs> Here, Goldie Piggledy. With the, with, with the numbers assigned to Sonic, Tails, and Knuckles, they have a, a very, very complicated Kama Sutra. <laughs> Aren't all the characters supposed to be, like, six? No. You can't eat chili dogs when you're six. You'll pop. Oh, that's... <laughs> no, you can't eat chili dogs when you're six because it's illegal. Yeah, it's illegal. The, the cops will pop you, that's what abuse. happens. <laughs> oh. They're when definitely, not, definitely not six. They're idiots, but they're not that dumb. When I where, was but a wee lad, my Where is the fucking father, train? How did it not hit us when we were running on the track? It's probably behind us at this point. Oh no. My, yeah, my it probably father, is. He made he made me eat chili dog. I asked him, Father, what are the ingredients of chili dog? He didn't know. Why would anybody tell me? <laughs> I just I just wanted to know what was chili dog. It's neither chili nor dog. So I've been, it's I've been, in fact, I've been rather warm and <laughs> hopefully not dog. I've been jamming the two processed versions of quartz into the into two of these buildings. Yeah, the all these well, things. The, whenever the train gets here, we'll have to pop it open and inspect it to see if it's got quartz in it or not. Or if it, when it gets here, we can watch it and see if it loads up quartz. I wonder if it did because when we, when it we got here, uh. Whatever the white one is, all the, the top like three slots were empty and I hit sort on it. So it might be carrying, yeah, silica. It might be carrying like three uh, rows of silica right now. Oh, could be, yeah. Maybe we're not offloading anything. Now I use several month if not over a year old stale jokes. Yeah, you got to fucking prabble with that one. Why don't you just wongle your way out of this chat right now? Wow. <laughs> what could go wongle? <laughs> Why don't you make like a box and go fuck yourself? <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, OG joke that no one understands because we had zero audience of any sort. Yeah, it's okay. That hasn't really changed all that much for me. <laughs> you get like uh, hundreds of views per day. I get 10,000 views a month, yeah. Yeah. I'm doing all right. I'm doing all right. I remember when I first felt encouraged was when I started getting like videos that would go up consistently and then get like a hundred views and I'm like oh, people <laughs> yeah my next uh, milestone it, is it like, only took like six years yeah man I get I, I'm 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 feeling relatively proud of myself it's kind of it takes a fair amount of work to get to the point that I have even if it's not like too impressive in some sense but Ooh, loud like, noises is that train I'm looking in the horizon and I see no train what did you do to our train I don't know. <laughs> what have you done? Here. It should be here, but it's not here, and that's kind of actually getting concerning. <laughs> Next stop, the quag mower is, is what the thing says. But, but where the fu there oh, here, it is. There it oh, is. Thank God. Oh, Yay! Thank God. It's alive. It's alive. Right, look, I'm gonna climb up on the thing so I can watch it. I hope that it just immediately just can go straight it's, through the just, train yeah, station. Yeah, it doesn't stop doesn't at all. Stop. Let me run yeah, oh yeah, and look like... at it. Look at it. It's got freight on it now. It's not just empty cars. Oh, okay. So I think it well, stops at the sto station and stop. then it gains whatever it has. Yeah, it's definitely slowing down. Boy, is it laggy as fuck to watch, though. Maybe it's better synchronized on your end, but for me, it is chonk. It's doing all right. So the back car is completely full of silica. So Ooh. I guess it's probably not unloading at all. Yeah, we probably need to Whoa, start to look at that. Look at that. I know that's that that's is so, so cool. cool. That is so I like, cool. I like it when people actually animate machines and games. I know. It's like the definition of superfluous animations in a video game. 
Like, I, that's my favorite stuff about, like, Alien Isolation and, like, anything that's, like, a retro-futurist sci-fi and spaceship thing is that they always, like, over-animate everything and you get to see everything move around. And you're like, yeah. Oh, I know. It's it's so cool Neat. in this game because it does have a lot. See you later, train. That seems to not be dumping any of those resources at the base. Because <laughs> when I arrived here, it was still full of silica. So something needs to be figured out back at the base. The, 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 the train is riding the invisible tracks right now. <laughs> Oh, so it's just flying through space <laughs> it for just you. just flew through the air. Oh, <laughs> boy. That was great. Okay, now's my favorite part where we go through the ground. Normally, trains require a tunnel to do this. Oh, did you? Not did, so. oh, oh, are you riding it? Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm driving the train. Yeah. It's phenomenal. I would recommend taking at least one tour of the, on the train because... Well, okay, never mind. The net code is... The freight cars are <laughs> ahead of the cabin right now. Whoa. Yeah. The net code on this thing is a joke. What Probably a confusing I'm visual. The ground. Yeah, I would imagine. Yeah. No, I uh, I expect patches to break half the shit you've made. I would expect <laughs> you to go fuck yourself for like even that, suggesting like, that. I totally expect patches are gonna come out and then just half the shit you've put down just won't work anymore because they're like they've op they've fixed half the shit that you've made and it doesn't right, do that the anymore. Was so bad that I didn't come to a stop whatsoever at the train station. So uh, I'm attempting to back up. Oh, because you're manually I'm, piloting it instead of letting it yes. drive itself. I'm I'm honestly I'm honest to God trying to get it to stop, but we're basically at the Caterium ore mine at this point. <laughs> it took that long to stop it with my frame rate. Oh God! All right, so all I'm gonna do is I'm gonna back it up to some point before the train station, and just put it back on autopilot so it comes to a stop on its own, and that way we can, like, figure it out from there. You know, no sapla. That's what we need to do. We need to set it up so that the third car fills with the Caterium ore. Yeah, we should have, like, another station there. Yeah. Oh, shit, this thing at base gravity. It's rolling downhill. Yeah, that too. That's a problem, because I made my thing go up hills, down hills, around hills. The works. Yep, you pretty much fucked us. We're pretty fucked. It's okay. I'm just gonna Welcome jump out of the train to Foxville now. Foxville population goes. us. Okay, that train is now officially on autopilot, I think, and hope. Alright, timetable. Wait, how do I set it up to automatically train? To automatically what? To automatically do the train schedule. The timetable? Yeah. It's uh, empty for me. <laughs> of course it is. I can't I can't control the, the timetable because the game... God damn oh, wait, it. it's doing its thing. Okay, it's doing it automatically. Yeah, because in okay. the train station itself, there's a timetable that just is the two stops, and it just goes to them. Okay. Well, I'm going to watch the train and see if anything gets unloaded. I don't think anything's going to happen, but I'll let you know. Oops, I fell off the platform by backing up too much, so now I can't tell you what happens. <laughs> <laughs> I accidentally made this one a cliffhanger. Does the fucking silica come off the train? Tune in next time for Dragon Bird. When we actually get there and try it again. Yeah. Okay, I legitimately fell off so much that I will not be able to get back up onto the platform in time. Uh, what, do you, what do you mean by back on the platform? Oh, there go. Whoa, hello train. Oh, it roars through. Goodbye. Alright, I'm on the freight platform and the they are empty. All of them are empty. Cool. Hooray! I might have to flip them all, since I had to flip the main one. Maybe that's the logic. I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, you may have to flip them, or we may need to have uh, some conveyor kind belts of, that take stuff off of them. Yeah, maybe. so that it knows to use them or whatever. Yeah. Some kind of um, Oh, demand. no, no. If you go up to the front... Freight platform. There's a button you can switch it to do a load it, be a loader or or a or a uh, unloader. Oh, so they're they're all in unloading mode or loading mode. Uh, these are all in loading mode, but yeah. they don't have any conveyor belts coming off of them, so they don't actually do anything. Well, I guess loading would be loading it onto the train. So I guess you need to put them in unloading mode. Oh yeah, you're right. We need to flip them onto unload mode. Yeah. And then they'll pick up whatever the train brings by. Okay, that All sounds right. awesome. Neat. 
I like yeah. the I like the animation and stuff too. I know the animation it's pretty is pretty uh, cool. It's pretty dank. I'm gonna stand on top of one of the freight platforms when it does its thing, so that I can see what happens if it does. Its so thing you can learn, yeah, gain and gain a new death message. <laughs> yeah. I mean, people have been clamoring for me to get hit by a train in this game. No joke. As soon as they, uh, as soon as I announced the return of this series with trains, people were like, you're gonna get hit by one, like. It's Maybe. my only purpose but... in life. <laughs> it's what I live for. I've been, I've been training for this since TF2, all right? Training. Yeah. Ah, are there trains in TF2? Yes, there's one level with trains in it in TF2, and if it hits you, you die. Ah. Just, just like in real life. It's very realistic. I still don't think there is a train in Overwatch anywhere. Uh, there are cars. Yeah. Which yep. are like small trains. Oh yeah, no, we played a, we played a really, a pretty neat, uh, custom mode where you're on like a overpass that's covering those cars because that's just uh -huh. a weird background scenery part of that level, and you have to uh -huh. try to run all the way down the overpass without getting hit by the cars. And you have that to sounds do it, and you really have, fun. And you have to do it as every character. Okay, that's that part. So it gets really increasingly difficult because they're sorted by the order of where it becomes more of a problem. Yeah, I imagine like. The easiest would be like Pharah. Because like, with, be... with like this character and that character, like, oh, I'm Winston, I can jump, and oh, I'm uh, I'm the character that has invincibility for a second and stuff like that. And then you get to like, Bastion. <laughs> <laughs> You're like, no, my options are be a giant slow moving mech or stop moving. That's my only ability. <laughs> this turret is useless. Or he could be, uh... The community um, is such yeah, a. Yeah, I think Bastion would probably be like the hardest one. It's pretty rough. Here it comes. The community is so spiteful towards Bastion that even if he is, whenever they have you sort through all the levels of all the characters in a row, the last hardest one's always Bastion. And if he does turn out to be well equipped for that type of level, then they gimp him so that he isn't. They'll spitefully, wow. they'll spitefully make him the worst character anyway. I thought that people would hate Kierbjorn more than Bastion. Kierbjorn's great. Tierbjorn is like even more like newbie than Bastion. You have to headshot people for, with like a carefully aimed shot. Or you don't have to and who gives a shit. <clears throat> Put down a turret. Uh, you lose then. <laughs> His turret's just not very strong. We always lose. Yeah, I, I, I win. Here it comes. Okay. Here it comes. All right, I'm on, I'm on the freight thing. Let's see if, uh, if I go on a little journey or not. Yeah, I do go on a journey. Just a small town bird living in a lonely train. It definitely just teleported the thing to make it match the location of the claw, because it was wrong. Oh, that's even better. Just a small town train. Dun, do, 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 chug, chug, living uh, in a lonely chug, train. Chugga, chugga, choo, 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 chugga, choo. Yeah, that makes perfect sense. <laughs> it just dumped yeah, that the was really fucking stupid. It just dumped the train car in the it freight Yeah, it dumped the entire train car in. It's just gonna instantly keep dumping more train cars in here. Like, hang on a minute. When I go to the storage of the freight platform, <laughs> there's literally, like, nothing in it to me. You don't see it? Nope. Are you going to the wrong one? Uh, I can check all of them, but none of them will show me this, their inventory. This one's empty. This one's full of quartz crystals, it's and this me. one's full of silica. Absolutely nothing about the trades. <sighs> Works with the net code apparently, because it's just fucking. They're all empty. Well, at least you get to see the train go around and go chuga chuga, and, and it will still that. and it will do it and it will still do its job, even if you can't see that's doing its job. So you can still do all the work that makes it work. You just won't. Uh -huh. You just have to like, assume you haven't fucked up, and that it is yeah, actually doing the right uh, resource. That's basically what I do when I play this game. You haven't been paying much attention, but actually, there's base two very far away from here that's already beaten the game. <laughs> that's literally impossible. Because I host I you, motherfucker. It's mine. <laughs> It's like how I can't secretly have made a bunch of progress in your Minecraft server. <laughs> gotcha, bitch. Gotcha. Higgledy that piggledy. that. Higgledy piggledy dock. The night goes <laughs> tick tock. 
No, it's the cow went oh, the cow went viral on TikTok. <laughs> uh, the kids were yeet and lit and shaking. <laughs> Literally shaking. Shook. They were le <laughs> damn it. What the fuck are you saying? <laughs> they were they were lit and yeet and shook. <laughs> That's a pretty yeet thing to say. <laughs> so now we need to figure out what to do with these resources when we put them out here. All right, so fun story. On this page with uh, the lyrics to Hickory Dickory Dock, you can get a printout of Hickory Dickory Dock uh, in black and white with a clip art of a mouse and all the text is in Comic Sans. Of course. Yes. It's meant for teachers who hate children. And because they want to typography. Teach them a really stupidly annoying song. In, and a, in, a, in, in an annoying font. Sans. Yay. Yep. Sweet prank, prank bro, we're gonna raise them all wrong. <laughs> <laughs> They're gonna come out fucked up. <laughs> Alright, so now that we got the quartz and the silica, what do we want to do is with it? Alright, we, we, have we haven't set a new things. goal yet. Oh, yeah. You're right. Explosives. Right. No. Okay. That's probably not that great, but whatever. Well, it's either explosives or... Oh, hang on a minute. Uh, put on your legs. Let's run over to the space elevator. I think it might be done. Okay. That's probably true. Um, but one thing I'm confused or wondering is... Uh, we've unlocked quartz things, but I don't know what we can manufacture quartz into. That's that's part of the research is you... Re uh, it wants yeah, us to well, research quartz oscillators. Like, we can okay, make well, quartz make oscillators. Quartz oscillator? It's in your thing. You're, we can already make, make it. it the, so... Make it in, at the craft bench? Well, I'm going to the... I can't check right now because I'm going to the space elevator. Okay, well, so am I. Give me one second. Yeah. Why did you tear up some of the conveyor that gets us here? Uh, because I didn't want to send the resource here anymore because it was done. Oh, fair. And now they're all done. Because we disconnect it because later we'll reconnect new things to those conveyors. Which are the new resources. You know what? That's a totally good point. Yeah. Alright, I'm here. You wanna press the Submit. thing? Okay. You wanna do the thing? I forgot, is this one of the things that works on your end? Yeah. No shit! Ah, oh, damn it! What did you do? I did... I was productive. Damn it. No. I did the right thing. God oh, damn it. Oh, God. No. <laughs> How will you ever be forgiven for progressing the game? I don't know. Goodbye, Space Levooter. People will be okay as long as I read more lyrics of Hickory Dickory Dock at them. It keeps looking uglier because every time we launch the space elevator, I've downgraded the graphics again. <laughs> oh. So yeah, it doesn't look too great right now. Yeah, I've ever, I've set to like low, I think, right now to make the game run well with the sheer amount of 3D assets going everywhere. And it's not, there's like a really silly through like EMP bomb effect happening on the, on, I know, on it looks its, like on a stuff. Starcraft fucking Here it comes. special effect <laughs> on that thing. Wait, is it coming back down already? Oh yeah, yeah there it goes. How come we can't ride the space elevator? Isn't there like a space restaurant that's like spinning around slowly in the sky at the top of the space elevator? Unavailable in early access. Well, wait, what? There's the there's the end of there's the end of our space elevator shenanigans for now. We've now unlocked yeah. the rest of the current early access. Okay, cool. Yeah, this game, uh, boy, it is. You're not joking. Walking through our base is um, laggy. Yep. Very, very so, laggy. So what can we research now? You check uh, it out while I grab all of these heavy modular frames so I can then disconnect the, tr the track. Okay, well I first need to make the quartz os oscillator. The quartz ocelot. And then, you know, we'll go from there. Well, that's for the different thing. You That's to, that's for the indoor computer. I'm wondering what we're going to research on the new tier we unlocked just now. Oh, okay. Let me look at that then. So, in Milestones, under Tier 7, we can research Nuclear Power. There it is. Bayer Process? What the fuck is a Bayer Process? 
Oh, well, it leads to uh, better miners, better conveyor belts, aluminium, and... Uh, uh, How dare you? A heat sink? We can, we can overclock our computers now. Yay! We have computers? <laughs> uh, we have supercomputers that we can research. Oh, shit. Yep. I can't pick up all these frames. Wow, we really suddenly have a lot of them when we didn't have any of them before. <laughs> so now I can turn it in just as a receptacle so we'll have a place to pick those up instead of them being constantly out, out all the time because they're all going here so that'll be nice yes yes it will be nice okay well I would uh, get some quartz oscillator going on but oh wow actually straight up like no 3D models are loaded on the conveyor belts for me anymore because the game oh no. wow <laughs> It's have that level of pants shitting itself. Have you capped out on loading 3D yeah, models? It's it, it straight up like every <laughs> conveyor belt is, as far as I can tell, completely empty. What the fuck? Wow. He's, <laughs> jokes on you, the base power is just off. <laughs> and it hasn't been making anything for the entire episode? Is that the joke, too? Yeah. Okay. Glad we're on the ha -ha, same channel. Funny joke. Funny joke. Got more, got more uh, one-liners there, Rorschach. Uh, you're in here with me. <laughs> uh, I hit a dog like in the head with an axe. It was a character moment. I mean, it was. It was. Okay, I'm gonna leave the server and have join you, back in. And have you read what? Watchmen? Yeah, I love Watchmen. Yeah, they're making a sequel to it. What? Again, they're making two sequels to it. <laughs> Who's they? There already is a comic book sequel to it, or prequel, or whatever, and then they're making us a Watchmen sequel television HBO series right now. Who's is they? Who made it? HBO. Uh, did Alan Moore help them? No, of course not. He, he, he Alan, Moore ne Alan Moore hasn't helped any of his adaptations ever. He hates them and doesn't watch them and denounces them all from existing. That's good. It's no All right, what about the guy that wrote Sin City? What? Is he helping out? Robert with that Rodriguez? One? Is that who that is? No, fucking no. Oh, I thought you meant the. I thought you meant the movies. Uh, no, because I think that was Robert Rodriguez. Uh, it, fuck, Frank what's his Miller. name? Frank Miller. Yeah, that doesn't he? Isn't he? Doesn't he kind of suck? No, actually, I was reading about this the other day. I don't really know why, but like he made that thing called Holy Terror, Batman. And then, like, apparently earlier this year, he, like, had, like came up in an interview and he was like, yeah, I shouldn't have done that. <laughs> and I was like, you know what? That's I heard that he he made some, like, iconic Batman series, but then made another Batman series where people's takeaway was that he never understood, he must have never understood what made his own previous Batman series good or something. Yeah, but that's I've never... kind of like a bunch of things that happened. Yeah, but I've never but... read that either, because the only Batman I've read is Killing Joke and White Knight. Oh, so the ones that he wrote. <laughs> no. Yeah, I thought I thought Frank Miller wrote uh, Killing Joke. I don't remember who, who did Killing Joke. Let's see. Killing Joke. Because I think Joke was... I think Killing Joke was from the Watchmen guy. You think it was Alan Moore? Yeah. Could be. Uh, Alan Moore has a lot to say about the Killing Joke. <laughs> Okay, so he probably wrote it. <laughs> uh, yep, written by Alan Moore and illustrated by Brian Boland. Oh, okay, so he, so cool. yeah, he made he made Killing Joke, which is the iconic Batman one-off that led yeah. that led to uh, specifically the creation of Oracle, because that's uh -huh. when Batgirl's back gets broken. Uh huh. She gets shot, and then she becomes Oracle in the follow-up comics. And then there's this, this whole idea that, of like comic books taking the wrong lesson from Killing Joke by just instead of instead of being about the storytelling and other stuff that he was going forward, they just became about being dark. And then led to a, oh, dec yeah. a decade of I, comics true. trying to be Killing Joke, but the wrong that's way. That's true. That did. That definitely did. And happen. then you have Edge Lord X Men characters with 500 belts and grimaces for f like f grimacing fists for faces and stuff. <laughs> Uh, God, who who did that shit? Uh, Rob the guy Liefeld? who can't. Yeah, the guy who can't draw feet. Oh yeah, I love. There's a fan. There's a fantastic 
uh, show where it's just Stan Lee shitting on Rob Liefeld in it to his face. I know that YouTube clip yeah. is so great. Where it's like, like some wow, kind of show. Got a... Yeah, it's yeah. some show where Rob Liefeld's gonna make a character as, as a gimmick. Like, look, he's gonna make a live on, on television and like... Stan's just shitting on him to his face yeah. the entire goddamn thing. Yeah, I know. He's like, wow, that guy's got a lot of belts on, doesn't he? Yeah. How, like, long, does yeah. He, how long does he take to put this all on? <laughs> <laughs> I know. It's so... Stan Lee apparently has amazing old man sass. Yeah, no, he's incredible. Yeah. Well, the trains must be doing its job. We just need to figure out what to do with its stuff next. Hooray. I like trains. They're cool. They are. I, I'm definitely enjoying the trains. There's in this something game. exciting that about setting said, up a train. I am fairly certain that this. Uh, I don't know what's going on with this game anymore, but it's just straight up not running. Yay! Like no, no items are appearing on any conveyor belts, and they're not moving anywhere, and have, so nothing's getting produced on my end. Have we like finally reached the object limit of the game for you, or something? I guess so. Maybe it's a setting that I can tweak. Did you ever try putting the game down to low? I could try that between sessions. Oop. Oh, I have enough resources for 10 crystal oscill oscillators. Oh, we were supposed to put nine. Oh, oh it I, needs I, 10. I can, I can jam I those in in. there. Okay, jam, jam at least nine in. Jam a ling -a ding dong. Eep op orc. Oh, I don't know why dong. it looks like a fucking PSP game. What, the fucking... Crystal Oscillator? Oh, yeah. yeah. And the Nobelisk? You see that in the list? I know. What is that? Alright, well, well, that'll be ready next session, because it's a 22-minute countdown. Cool. We'll learn about yeah, that this game thing. game is absolutely shit itself. And, well. Uh, so have I. And I think that's a good <laughs> enough note to end this one the on. The series does not want you to, to be in it. <laughs> no, it's fine. It's trying to eject you forcefully. <laughs> yeah. Like the poopy that I am. <laughs> the poopy. Gross. Alright, well, oh, I'm gonna good. stop streaming for the Good evening. night, everybody. Bird's computer's yeah, having a stroke. Yeah. So now he's gonna have a stroke. Uh. I know we need to know my jerk off schedule. Bump. <laughs> My itemized schedule <laughs> with <laughs> with with notes. I mean, and, <laughs> you probably keep it, you probably keep it, minutes of your dude, jerk off if schedule. You're <laughs> if you're a professional sperm donor and you jerk off, that's a tax write off. Mm -hmm.